Now to help introduce the seminar, I'm going to hand it over to our Head of Academic Services in UCC Library, Alan Carberry. Thank you, Stephanie. I uh, appreciate you opening the session for us. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, more a Coroy of Gulair, Quig our OCOD special to you. Uh, I'm so delighted to welcome you all to our special event, our special seminar series today. Uh, this has been a, a good number of months in the making, and we're really excited to uh, share the programme with you today and very excited to be working with the National Forum for Enhancement of Teaching and Learning uh, to bring you this as part of their seminar series. And very much looking forward to uh, the day today and hope you are too. Uh, I just want to give a little bit of context, a little bit of an introduction as to why myself and my colleagues in the library here in University College Cork are presenting this seminar to you. Why is the library invested and interested in this topic and why have we brought you all together today? Why have we offered this programme? Uh, like many libraries up and down the whole globe, really, uh, we're all exploring new services, new technologies, new spaces as a way to explore how we share, consume, and even create knowledge and information. Uh, and we're very interested in exploring new emerging technologies as part of our services. We're interested in exploring how we might provide enhanced access to some of our collections through things like VR and other uh, spaces and services and technologies that we're currently working with. UCC Library, again, like many other libraries, has created a dynamic space master plan that really uh, sets a vision for the creation of new technology rich spaces and services in our library and again like many other libraries and educational spaces uh, on our campuses we're exploring 3d printing one touch recording studios podcasting studios and many other services coming on stream as part of our offering and vr and immersive technologies is absolutely a part of that i suppose that uh, frame that we're looking at as well uh, here in ucc library right before the pandemic we opened up our Digital Environments Lounge, which was a dedicated space that we created for our students, our staff, our researchers to come in and explore the use of immersive technologies uh, like VR, uh, but with a, a hope to grow and adapt the, the types of technologies that are available. And obviously the pandemic hit and so we had to stall our plans while the library closed, but happy to report that when our library reopened uh, in summer of 2020, we were able to bring our new spaces and our new services back online. And certainly over the past academic year, our students and our staff have been making good use of our digital environments lounge, of our library studio, of our 3D printing services and other spaces and, and offerings that we're providing. Uh, we're very keen in the library to engage in a conversation conversation with our colleagues around the use of immersive technologies to enhance the teaching and learning and research experience in our community. And I suppose like any good conversation, it's important that we in the library don't have that conversation in our own little bubble, that we don't have it with ourselves. Uh, and that's why I'm really excited that the local organising committee have curated such a diverse programme, diverse, I suppose, in, in many respects, diverse in the fact that you'll hear today from speakers at the very local level. You'll hear from some of my colleagues both inside and outside the library here in University College Cork. You'll also hear from colleagues right across the country. Uh, I know that we have some folks here from UCD um, uh, who will talk to us about their experiences with immersive uh, technologies and VR. And you'll also hear far more globally, you'll hear from a number of speakers in the afternoon or in the later afternoon, uh, particularly from the US and very excited to get that international perspective uh, as well. But I'm also particularly excited that you'll hear from a diverse range of speakers in terms of where they come to this conversation. We have a lot of library staff, both in our audience and presenting today. We also have educational technologists. We have academics and faculty. And again, that rich variety of experience coming together is really what was the draw for us to have this conversation to today. But I'm particularly, particularly excited to welcome uh, some student voice into our conversation today. And I know that my colleague Stephanie is presenting with Daniel. Hi, Daniel, uh, on his experience of using our spaces here in the library. And so for those of you who are coming to join the conversation, we really encourage you to make good use of the chat, to ask questions of our speakers. Uh, looking forward to getting the conversation started. We will also have a panel discussion towards the end that I'm delighted to moderate. And so again, looking forward to hearing some 
some of the questions that you all have uh, for our speakers today. So I suppose whether you're VR curious or perhaps even VR skeptical, whether you're an ex or expert, or whether you're just really interested in thinking about how immersive technologies can enhance your teaching, your students' learning, your research experience, or the spaces and the services that you provide, we're really excited to present this seminar for you today. So I'm going to stop talking and pass over. I'm going to pass over to my colleague Molly, who's going to chair our first part of our sessions. Thanks everyone, talk to you soon. Molly, over to you.